All right, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to import your Identity IQ credit report. So, I already have some of my credentials in there, so I'm just going to log into whatever my social, click save. And once you enter your credentials properly, you want to go ahead and click Test Identity IQ. And basically, what that's going to do is that's going to test whether your credentials are correct. And you want to do this to make sure that you aren't logging into Identity IQ with the wrong username and password, because if you do it, I believe five times or more they'll lock you out of your account and you'll have to call them it's real simple to get your account unlocked they'll email you and you just call them and they'll unlock it right away um, so as you can see it's good uh, the next thing you want to do when you know that your credentials are good you want to go ahead and click refresh report and basically what that's going to do is that's going to bring in a fresh new report uh, with credit fixer you can refresh report report credit report every 30 days so um, yeah. So this process typically takes, you know, I would say 30 to 40 seconds, 40, 30 to 40 seconds. And it's also actually analyzing your credit report to find all the negative items in your credit report. So that's why it takes a bit longer than normal. Um, but I'm going to fast forward through this and when it's done. All right, there you go. It's complete. It was a success. Uh, your last credit pool date was January 27th. Uh, next available credit pool is February 22nd. You can check out your credit report here. Your credit report has all your information. Again, like I told you, it'll check and find all negative items on your credit report for you to dispute. There you go.